this looks dangerous today, but what we're going to do is, well, we'll do something dangerous, but what we're going to do is make a plasma, a visible plasma that will rise into the air. So this was going to be our trick. So first, let's try to understand uh, what's happening with our setup here. So what this is called is an induction coil. And you can see we have this sort of iron core here. We have um, uh, a voltage that's being transformed from a low voltage with a low number of coils to a high voltage, so up to 10 kilovolts of electricity. So what's going to happen here is um, that air has a certain dielectric strength of 3 kilovolts per millimeter. Um, and we've got 10 kilovolts here, and we have about 3 millimeters of space here. So this is enough of a voltage, enough of an electric field to ionize the air. And ionizing the air means the electrons are stripped from the air, and we basically have produced a plasma. When this electrons uh, recombine with our with our ions, we get we should see um, some type of spark. And because this this process heats the air, this spark actually will rise because the hot air rises, and we'll see this this spark kind of go up, rise up to the top here. So from down, then it goes up. Let's see if this actually works. So here we have this setup here. So we're going to turn on this transformer. So we're going to turn the uh, low number of, uh, of the low amount of voltage up to a higher amount of voltage. So let's turn this on and see if this works. Okay, oh, there it is. There's our, sp there's our spark. So this is uh, 10 kilovolts over a few millimeters, and we see it's kind of pretty cool. Um, if I can tilt this a little bit. And um, maybe I can just show you just how much electricity is in here, how much energy we've got. See? Okay, I better put this out. <laughs> and I'm back. So let's turn this off. So there you have it. We made a plasma. We see the plasma rising. We see the spark. Uh, it's a pretty cool experiment. It's not magic, it's physics. Well, thanks for watching. It looks like I survived today. Um, but if you want to find out if I survive the next experiment, then um, remember to click like, click subscribe, and I'll see you next time.